Gina. Today I wanted to show you a few things that I have on sale on my website store. Um, I am doing some spring cleaning and I'm trying to get rid of some excess inventory. So instead of just marking down a few things or putting extra things up and marking them down, I just put everything in bags and I'm marking them way down. So you're getting a bundle of beads for really incredibly cheap prices. I have made a surprise stash builder bag that is completely random. Um, all kinds of different strands of beads. Only beads, strands, and loose beads, and a couple pendants are in these bags. No metal components. So you're getting a great deal because beads are generally more expensive than the metal components. So I have marked this down to $30. Normally my surprise stash bags are $37. So I've marked this down. There's lots in it and more beads than usual. I have shown you before, but I have metal stash bags. Also, these are all metal components, and these ones in particular are really packed because there's a lot of packages of little charms and things in them. They're all very different, so we're not gonna go through these individually. I'm just going to show you basically what's inside so that you can see that they're not a bunch of junky things and know that you're getting a great deal. And if you want them, head on over to the store because I'm hoping they sell out pretty quickly. They're pretty limited. So um, I just wanted to give everyone a chance that sees this to do this. I've also made some little pendant pouches that have about 20 little packages in here. They're small pendants. You can use them as charms too. Um, these work perfect for gifts if you want to use with some beading chain or something. You can make a whole bunch of little uh, minimal type necklaces or you can use them as charms like I said and then I have a gemstone pack that I have made that are not curated none of this is curated it's just random beads put together so um, I'm still debating on the price of this one I think it's going to be $27 simply because there's a lot less in it than this one but these are gemstones so I'm going to show you just the quantities and let you have a little glance here when I very first opened my website, my mom was sick and I was just trying to make a little money so I could stay home and take care of her because I was working full time as a dental assistant. So um, I started making stash builder bags in the very beginning to get rid of some of my personal stash and stash that I've had for years and they went over really well. So I kept doing them but then I started buying stuff for them and then I started cleaning out my inventory and putting things in bins and so pretty soon I had these big batches of beads in these great big stackable containers and um, I just have so many and now I'm going to make more um, treasure bags so I want to mention that too, this is not a treasure bag. Um, I'm going to make more treasure bags, so I need more storage room. So what I'm trying to do is just clear everything out. As you can see, this is a huge amount of beads. And they're all very pretty, very nice beads. Things you, I use in my tutorials, things that you can string with. You can do some bead weaving because there's different sizes in here. Um, this one in particular doesn't have a lot of really tiny ones, but it has four millimeter rounds, six millimeters, some cubes, some different specialty type components, and some um, pendants, just a bunch of things like that. And some of these column beads, you can see some crystal, lots of really pretty things. There's at least 25 bags in each one of these. Each um, bag will have a 25 pouches, but most of them have a little bit more than that. But at least 25. Here's some little flower beads. I'm going to dump another one out just so you can see. They're all different. They may have some repeat strands and some repeat components, but um, no bag is like the, the last one. They're all very different. So here's another bag. And you can see I've got some glass pearls, some pendants, some bigger beads, some small beads, all kinds of stuff in here. 
and this is $30. These are some of the six millimeter round um, English cut. Here's some big cubes. Here's a big drop. Here's some of these pretty um, barrel shaped beads. So some crystal, just a whole bunch of stuff in each bag. And like I said, not gonna go through it because inevitably someone will say, I want the bag just like you had. And none of them are just like that. And I can't accommodate that. So I don't want anyone to um, get disappointed. Well, here's some uh, bicones. There's all kinds of stuff in these bags. Now I've got it mixed up. I don't know if this goes in that one or... <laughs> okay, I'll figure that out. So those are the surprise clearance surprise stash builder bags. They are $30 and they're available now. They are limited, so if you want one, you need to go get one quickly. I made these, I had tons of pendants laying around because I was making pendant stash builder boxes. And then um, I just decided to just individually package them all. There are repeats in this, but that's okay because they're small. So if you get a repeat like these two, you could make earrings if you want or whatever you want. But there is at least 20 or I'm going to say approximately 20 bags in these um, little pendant stash builder bags. There's all kinds of cute little pendants in here. Each bag is totally different. Some of them have bigger pendant, pendants. Some of them have smaller. Most of them are pretty petite, but there's a lot of pendants in here. So you could make a lot of gifts out of this and um, get, be creative and have fun with these. You can use them as charms, you can do all kinds of things. This bag is $15, so that means you're paying less than a dollar a pendant, and um, I think that's pretty good. So it's $15 for this bag. And then for the gemstone bags, they're all very different. I just took a bunch of the strands I had left over and just hanging out in my storage room and I just put them in a bag. And you're gonna get 10 to 15 items in one of these bags. So there's some individual gemstone beads, there's some pendants, you can see there's some strands. Um, some strands are a little bit shorter than others. That's the way I got them. Like here's some pink quartz pebbles. And um, I think, like I said, I'm, and they're substantial. Good, this is smoky quartz. They're, you know, average to a little above average type of gemstones. Some of them are a little bit nicer than others, but they're all very, very good gemstones that you can create with. And um, I think this bag is gonna be $27. So that's, um, if you have, let's say there's just 10 strands in here. So that's $3 a strand of gemstones. That's pretty cheap. So of course there's other things in there too, but you know, I'm just kind of estimating. And then here's the metal stash builder bag. This one is really packed. Um, they're all very different. There's tons of stuff in these, and you can just kind of see there's just lots of stuff in here. So um, there are connectors, there are charms, there are, in some of them, there are components such as clasps, there's chandelier components. This one has a lot of charms in it. <laughs> My stepfather was packing these and he got a little carried away with the charms. I told him to spread them out through the bags, but um, no. There's, they're pretty, a lot of them are charm heavy. Some of them are not. They're more component heavy. They're all very different. But this is $15, my friends. And um, this is way worth more than 15. I haven't marked them down. I've been selling them for 15. Um, but the price will eventually go up because like I said, with this one and especially the way my, my, uh, stepfather packed these, um, they're worth a lot more. 
he didn't really follow my directions but they're made and they're ready and you're getting a bargain so I'm just gonna leave it at that you know things happen you know it's just men they don't listen oh I shouldn't say that I have men on here sorry guys so this is what I have on sale right now and um this is under a hundred dollars if you got all of these pieces and you get a ton of stuff to make things with so um, whether you get them all or just pick out one or another that's perfectly fine go to the stash builder page and they'll all be on the stash, Bu stash builder page on my website you may have to push the the um, little part that says load more because usually it's just this one and this one on there but after I get four on there it may push the surprise stash builder down and you'll have to um, click the little um, load more thingy on the website you know I have really technical terms don't I jeez anyway that's what's going on I will post a link to that page on the in the information box beneath the video player and I'll also put it in the comments and or you can just head on over to the website and pick yourself up some and I just want to show you that give everyone a chance to get them they are very limited if they sell out really fast I apologize but you know they're there and I want to clear them out I want to clear them out as quickly as I can and I appreciate it appreciate your help in giving them new little homes so that I can have more space in my home. Okay, that's all I got to say. I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.